you hear me? Okay, nice. Thank you. Okay, Alessandro is already there. No? Not here yet. Okay. Okay, nice, nice.
Hello, hello, and welcome back to Memory Sports TV today on YouTube and two channels today with an Italian commentary uh, in this description and the English commentary with Simon Reinhardt, the man himself. And uh, hello, Simon, welcome to the uh, stream. Because this will be the task of our two Italian commentators on the other stream. But I'm happy to be here and looking forward to a great match. Cool. So you were not unmuted from my side for the first 30 seconds, uh, 20 seconds. So nobody heard your Italian commentary. I'm very Nobody sorry heard my that. Italian commentary. <laughs> then I won't repeat it again. Okay. Nice. Andrea, good to have you here. Um, yeah, Alex, today um, you played in the last year. We just talked about that two times. Uh, you won a match each and a uh, third match today. So... How is it for you? Is it a different thing to play against Alex and playing all the other people in the season, or how do you feel today? It's really exciting because it's, I think, the the only match for me in which it's like really, you know, on the same level. Yeah, and uh, it it sounds like that uh, you always um, you always a bit more relaxed before the matches. Today it's a bit more of a different story, but I don't want to I'm, talk. I'm focused. I'm... I, I don't want to talk you too much into something. But you are a professional, so uh, I think you don't care about what I'm talking here. So uh, Italian commentary is not working for me. Uh, Ronald Johnson, no, there is no Italian commentary on that stream, but there is an Italian commentary on the other stream in the description. You should click on the link. There is the Italian commentary. Yeah, I think they will start it in a minute. Ah, okay. I didn't start yet. Okay. So we're still waiting for Alex here. And um, in the meantime, we can check a bit of the stats here, Simon, if you want. Absolutely. Yeah. And uh, I'm not sure. I mean, you can see it also then on YouTube. Did you have it open? Not so yet. that we can check. talk about it. And it's on your YouTube channel, right? On the Memory yes. Sports TV. Yes. And let me check. I will keep an eye on Alex here if he's joining us. And he will, but the when. So we here we go. Twenty people watching. Nice. So let's um, check. Just yeah. Just a general question. It's um, announced yes, it's season thirteen final, but it's actually season twelve, right? No, it's season thirteen. On Memory League, it's called season twelve. Yeah, yeah, it's season 12. But it was was announced before you both reached the final. So I think... Yeah, I that's why season 12, because season 12 is already clear that they are in the final. Simon. <laughs> it's for both already clear, but certain... certain ah, okay, season... Certain, ah, okay, I know, I get it. Okay, you are right, Simon. I was wrong. <laughs> It's a season no, 12 final. Uh, rare uh, happiness for me to be right. Anyway, it's a final and uh, the other final in three weeks will be, um, I would say, um, exciting too, because um, nice. someone has to lose today. And I'm really excited to see also how that develops then in the next match. So, but anyway, so let's take a look on some stats here. Um, yes. Breakdowns for, or let's check, check the top 10 first, because they're both very close together in the top 10 too. And uh, let's take a look on numbers first. We have here um, Alex with 11.8 as his top score and Andrea with 11.4 as his top score. So yeah, close together here. Mm, I can't really see it's, any big difference here. Is this already visible? Because I can't see it on YouTube. It should be visible now. Okay. It's a bit... Uh, Sure. Um, yeah, perfect. Line, yes, yes, yeah. yes, 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 yes. Yeah, interesting thing. I mean, Andrea can still hear us probably. So, uh, but yeah, I think I numbers is a very interesting. Um, it's a very interesting matchup. I mean, Alex did an impressive thirteen point point six against uh, Bastian in his recent semifinal. And um, yeah, I guess the the normal thing to to say would be that they are very evenly matched here my guess is still just a feeling that andrea might be a very very tiny bit better here but it's very hard to pin down it's i think it's uh, such a small difference that it's much more interesting that uh, it's much more probable that the um, shape that they are 
in a uh, certain day uh, makes a difference. Right. And Alex is here. Hi, Alex. Hey, guys. Already How Christmas behind you. Please. Hello, Alex. Greetings. <laughs> hey. hey, Andrea. Cool. So, Alex. Nice to see you. You too. Alex, do you um, mind setting up a second camera or you want to just. Yeah, I, I have it here. I was, okay. I was waiting a second. Um, Fine. Cool. Yeah, let me do that. Do I need that? So this is at season 12, the final. I was um, calling it differently here, but yeah, it's uh, season 12 final. And Alex just setting up, Andrea already ready, and then we are ready to go. So the rules, Simon. Yeah, I think the rules, as far as I recall it from my final, it is best of three sets, uh, best of four in each set with a difference of two and no surprise event, I think. No surprise event. No. Yeah. Uh, no, uh, sorry, no no tiebreaker, right? In the third yeah. set? No, in all sets? I think the tiebreaker is just for the slams, right? Else we can just check. Yeah. Maybe we check that before we start. Or yeah. do, just, do to, just to make sure, because the, the tiebreaker always was something that I always had in my mind for the slams. Just to make sure seasons... You see, we are not ashamed to take a look into the rules as it should be. Um, page number six. You shouldn't be ashamed of that. Absolutely. Uh, regarding promotion, general rules, six games. I cannot choose scoring. Six games, blah, blah, blah. Exciting game. Finals. Yeah, there's no tie break. It's mentioned expressly in other rules. No tiebreak yeah. anywhere. So no, there's no tiebreak in any set. Okay. And um, each set being the first to four games with a two-game lead, and the choice of events is reset, is uh, reset if a score reaches five-five. So it's very similar, as they already know in that regard. And um... yeah. yeah, thank you. So yeah, yeah that's Alex, it. Alex, Andrea, are you ready to uh, go? Any questions? Uh, yeah, just what you have just said, said bef before. Uh, the choice of set 5-5. Five, five. So let them break and... If it's a 5-5 five, five, uh, or... If uh, it's a 5-5, five, five, then you can choose again, then you can choose words for the second time or whatever. Yeah, sure. Okay, clear. Yeah. yeah. Okay, anything from your side, Alex? I think so. Okay. So in both of you, good luck for the match. Good luck. And good luck. enjoy that. And yeah, talk to you afterwards. Andrea will have the first choice on the left side. So yeah, let's go. Let's okay. go. Good, Good luck. luck. Have a great match. Good luck. And we stop our yeah, we video stop transmission our now, yes. Great. Yes. Okay, nice. Nice. I'm really excited now. It's like being here for Christmas. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> and uh, the good thing is that it's that now, a few days before um, some countries Santa Claus is coming around the 6th of uh, December. It's the first one, and shortly before Christmas will be the second one. Very nice. Yes, that's uh, and as I mentioned before, this is uh, really cool. I mean, someone has to lose today, and yeah. having having that other match in three weeks is like a rematch. It feels maybe yeah, absolutely. A bit like it's, that, it's, right? I mean, it's almost almost perfect. Yeah, it is like almost as if they had waited to play their season twelve final just in order to make it more interesting for the spectators right and yeah i just opened the uh, cards uh, stats here yeah so alex with a slight advantage here i would also say the same yeah so alex is um that's my that's my guess i think alex is more comfortable around these 14 to 15 second times mm -hmm. Now you see here, wow, between 14 and 16, mm -hmm. seven out of seven is incredible. This is, yeah, super strong. I mean, absolutely incredible. Almost never makes any mistakes on cards. Actually, there's one game not in here, uh, which he uh, failed lately. But uh, yeah, he's so strong on cards and uh, definitely one of his favorite disciplines here. Yeah. And Andrea, also lately, I think he got more safe in cards. So there was a time where he was uh, prone to a bit more like these 50 cards or um, 48 or something. So I guess the statistics might be if you 
where to take, let's say, very recent games, like the last 20 or so, mm -hmm. might be maybe a bit higher than 72.5, but um, definitely um, advantage to, to Alex here. And, and you also see Alex more, more often um, goes into these uh, 16 to um, 79.9 and in these 18 to 19.99 times. And he also has the higher accuracy there. So, yeah, I mean, what's, what do we take from these numbers? I would say. Yeah, uh, that's the question. It's, I think, basically, I guess Alex will, will go for a time of at least 15 point something, at, at least because he must know that 16 might, might not be enough. Um, I could imagine Andrea going for something very fast, like 13 or so, and then doing like 48 or so or something like this. So my guess would be, I think... I think Andrea always wants the momentum in a match and always a bit of the um, initiative saying that, that he is the one who has the faster time and he's the one who is dictating at the pace and so on. I think that's where he's feeling comfortable. And I guess he will be faster than, than Alex and Alex will, will go for a very fast time, but which is still safe. So like, I, I, if you ask me 14.8 for Alex versus 13.8 for Andrea and Alex gets it and Andrea maybe 50 cards or so. Interesting. And what do you think? What's the first choice from an Andrea here? Images or we don't. Know Andrea yet. has the first choice, right? Because yeah. he's in the higher seat. Yeah. Um, interesting question. It's images. It's images. Already yeah. answered that question here. And... Yeah, I mean, he's much stronger than, than Alex there, so it's the biggest strength difference of all the disciplines. Um, so I guess he thinks if he's going for a time of seventeen, that it works might be an opportunity for Alex to, to catch him. And here we go. The match is under, under attack. <laughs> Alex uh, versus Andrea. Not the match. I mean, yeah, you know what I mean. The match, okay. <laughs> and here we go. Alex. Alex faster. with the higher pace. Wow. 12. Wow. Oh, wow. That okay. would be a huge start for him. <clears throat> I think I'm not sure Alex was, was ever faster than 13 seconds. In his, uh, I've never seen... Um, Images of sub 13 seconds for no, Alex. not in the top 10. Um, 13.1 <coughs> was the uh, top 10 in the last year. Yeah. Um, wow. Okay. So that would be, yeah, let's see. I mean, he was uh, lately less in the last match. He was saying that he is also training a bit um, <coughs> right now and every day or at least something every day. Yeah. So let's see. It would be it would be a huge feat to uh, break Andrea here. Yeah. I don't quite believe it yet, so I would need to see the start of the recall here, how how that thing goes. Um, but I mean, the safe bet would be, yeah, that Andrea gets it and that Alex has like twenty four or something. <clears throat> okay, recall starts. Yeah, but yeah, let's let's wait for it. But of course, that would be uh, that would be a, also. I mean, this is also mentally. Yeah, I mean, Andrea is prof a, a professional, but still, it would be a very very tough defeat in the first game. Yeah, him. I think. Um, I mean, it did. I think the defeat would not be that tough in a way, in my opinion, because Andrea, even let's just say, even if Alex gets it now. Then Andrea must know that that Alex most probably will not get this in every match because you cannot improve that much on images within a month or so. Yeah. So I mean, Alex, when when he tries times under twenty seconds, I think his accuracy is around sixty or so. And um, so I think it will, but it will it would change his calculations uh, because of course you you have a strategy which in a way uh, has your safe disciplines as a stronghold and then the 50 50 disciplines where you know where you have to go for a bit more risk and if you're and if one of your stronger disciplines suddenly seems not so safe anymore you might need to change your approach a bit but i think alex has some trouble here with there's yeah. and yeah i mean he's just uh, not in the right position here but andrea also not Andrea with two switched solid. ones would of course be incredible like a 28 28 with a faster time for alex <laughs> <laughs> i think that nobody is at the more I, this this might even be strategically more more demanding for Andrea 
<coughs> to Time, if yeah, yeah, yeah. Alex doesn't get it, yeah. Alex with a location swap. 9, 10, and... Yeah, with a location swap, yeah. 11, 12. But Andrea also not done yet. Okay, and Andrea we are now fixing. correcting something. And Drea now probably with um, yeah twenty eight. Yeah. Okay, Alex and with the Drea with a on location swap. So or no no, it's I mean if he goes in two, then it's between two locations. Yeah. 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 Um, Alex needs twenty eight at the moment. But the point is, I think, I think. I mean, it would of course be totally crazy. Let's let's say he now makes a mistake in like cell twenty one and twenty two, and then he notices the uh, location swap, and then he has twenty eight. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but yeah, let's see, let's see if he can fix these first two here. Uh, the last last minute. I think Alex is not one who is correcting very often. Yeah, probably. I mean, it's it's still. I mean, it's it's the nice sign here from Alex. Yeah, yeah. Anyway, hmm. is it clear if Alex has already logged in? No, he didn't. He didn't. Okay. He hmm. didn't log in yet, so. But it seems he's also not really. Um. Yeah, he's not really seen. playing with the locations. Andrea also didn't log in yet. So, yeah, but it, that looks like we have the 1 0 lead here for Andrea. Yeah. 10 seconds. Yeah, I would say next images match. If, if I were in a, oh. uh, Alex shoes, then I would definitely go for a slower time and hope that Andrea goes for a very fast time. <clears throat> I think it's a good start for Alex psychologically. Yeah. That I agree on that here, and I guess uh, yeah, you you heard that here from Andrea. Yeah, it was loud moaning here, <laughs> and uh, yeah, first game. Interesting. Images goes to Andrea. Okay, next choice. I'm Choice pretty of sure Alex, probably cards. cards. Yeah, I'm pretty sure about that. Yeah. What do you think will be the, let's say, pivot discipline today, the discipline that will be the deciding factor and whatever? So maybe words? Yeah, words, but maybe also names, international names yeah. or mm -hmm. national names. Let's see what yeah, I think international choose. names is definitely a plus four for Alex. But it's closer than um, yeah, it's closer, than it was because Andrea really improved here. Uh, for example, yeah. he, he he beat um, Bastian two times in international names lately. Yeah, Bastian got like sixteen, right? Yeah, sixteen, seventeen. But yeah, having a yeah, Andrea has this on an eighteen average. Yeah, that's mm -hmm. that's good. Sure. And I don't know what like Alex average is. I would guess it's nineteen or twenty, but. He's maybe not as consistent. I think Andrea rarely goes below 18 nowadays, right? Yeah, I think so too. And I mean, this is the last year, of course. So as you said, we don't have the recent, let's say, 20 games. That yeah. would be also very interesting, true. Uh, that. Right, right. And it's cards. We can all see that from the Very screens. nice. Yeah, let's see if mm, what Andrea's strategy is here. I will post the YouTube link on the memory leak page if that's okay. Uh, sh yeah, but uh. it's there, so. Ah, yeah, sure, yeah, yeah. sure. They only need to press <laughs> but, live yeah. just in case someone doesn't know the live button. Yeah, <laughs> then they are also served now. Okay, and here we go. On. <laughs> Yeah, I think Andrea goes for something like 13 and Alex goes for 14 or 15. <clears throat> okay. I think Andrea will try to do the same now that yeah. Alex tried to do to him. True. Yeah. Pro okay, here we go. It's a person action object versus a two card system battle here. Andrea slightly. 
Pasta! Wow! 0.4 seconds for Andrea. Wow. And yeah, I mean, for cards, we have seen that before. I can't see anything here for Andrea with this time, so he didn't do that. I mean, he, uh, of course, has surprised people again and again. It's also sure. at the Arena of Memory where he did the 11 seconds in numbers. Sure, yeah. So, yeah. But it's more than a second faster than his uh, yeah. best and this time. Is, this is huge in this thing. I mean, even for, for me, uh, as not, 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 not even, but for, for me, um, 17 seconds cards feels completely different to 16 for an example 17 is still something that is good 16 is something possible but you really need to be on a good pace and you really need to be very very concentrated and yeah for these i think for, for these two there's also a huge difference between 14 and 13. okay let's see how the recoil let's goes see. Post was a good recall so far, Andrea. Yeah. Like also very impressive. Thirteen point something versus thirteen point something and both. This is incredible. <laughs> Just recalling here. And now Alex was some thinking. Yeah, what I what I also noticed with, with, with Alex, Alex, if he if he has a gap, then he is not willing to admit this immediately. So he always tries for five mm -hmm. or ten seconds or so longer to to fill this. Mm -hmm. and I think this is an interesting approach. Okay, there's one misplaced card, but I guess he will uh, be able. Yeah, now he is at the misplaced card. He will now yeah. fix that. Andrea, in the meantime, here 48, 49, just three cards well, left. I mean, he has only three three cards missing, and uh, wow, yeah. I mean, very little chance that he. Wow, oh, nice one! Oh, yeah, incredible, super. And Alex losing with a thirteen seconds. <laughs> wow. I mean, this is very close to the best Alex has done in the last year. And Andrea with would be interesting, but the the uh, software shows, yeah. If it even says it's a personal record, I don't know. Wow. Yeah, let's see. But definitely a top five score ever. Wow, this is incredible. This is super strong. Super, super strong from both here. Wow. Oh. Simply filling those those gaps and then in two minutes. I mean, they both have two impressive. minutes left. They both have two minutes left here. And yeah, uh, yeah this is another level. Um, I don't see anyone else who is capable of that today. Yep. And that's right this is and i mean they're not just doing that once they're doing that <clears throat> very very often and that's even more exciting and uh, yeah very impressive and uh, Sarochi, uh, uh, advising alex and chat not to break the table <laughs> a very good advice <laughs> that people should heed <laughs> yeah. But I can't see any athlete breaking their table if things don't go right. Yeah. Right, uh, right, right. But maybe a commentator. Maybe a commentator, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So watch out. <laughs> Be careful. Don't, so people... don't, don't do anything rush, you have. <laughs> people are shocked. And oh, Alex! Andrea. Uh, uh, okay, okay. Andrea playing here with the, the audience. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> sure. This is just because he's bored, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> They're both waiting for the time here. Yeah? So yeah. no one is clicking anything yet. They both take the time also to have a break, I guess. Um, yeah, but I think also because you, you see that they are both not entirely sure. Maybe that's also a difference that they... Oh, what? Andrea? Alex is done and Andrea is... Andrea changing stuff. Wow. But I think he will... But, but I think he will change it back again. 15 seconds. I think he will change it back again. T -t -t 10 seconds. Okay, he would need to start now. <laughs> he is wow. not changing it. He, wow. Wow. What? Wow. That was crazy. Wow. wow. Incredible. 
Okay. Well, yeah. I, That's of I, course. I didn't see that coming. So I didn't see that coming. No, no. <laughs> That was, uh, yeah, I mean, a Dell deserved points for Alex, of course, but uh, if a huge outcome here, I, wow. You don't, yeah, actually, but I mean, and, yeah, Andrea doesn't change too much here, usually. Yeah, yeah but that's, that's what I was like saying, yeah, so that, that they are waiting that long shows that they are still thinking. Yeah. And that they're not quite sure. And yeah, maybe Alex was a bit surer about the, the whole thing. And yeah. What did Andrea really change? Wow, yeah, two locations, I guess. So six cards. Um... Yeah, but also the, the order. The order also? Yeah, 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 yeah you see, he has like um, no. seven and nine, but there comes the two before. No, no, he has a... Ah, yeah, ah, no, sorry, because he memorizes in uh, threes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, 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 right. Yeah, well. But it's still, I mean, uh, it's 25 cards per row, isn't it? So, um, uh, 26, so... Yeah. I don't know exactly what went wrong here. And yeah, so no long break here. Next discipline already here locked in for bows. It is, what is it? Is it, um, it's hard to see. What is Andrea choosing? Words or what? No, I see these names, isn't it? Is it names? National names. National names. Mm -hmm. Okay. So he feels he has such a big plus over... Alex there, or maybe he wants to get it out of the way. Yeah. They are everywhere very close to each other here. And I yeah. mean, you have to choose something. Okay, where we go? Yeah, you are right there. Choose something. Okay, national names. So top 10, um, yeah, in favor of Andrea. And in... I don't think both will get 30, honestly. Yeah. Both were... That would, I mean, maybe they are now super, super concentrated and at their top level, and then of course they will get it. But if you take a look at the past results, then it was rather often so that both didn't get 30. I mean, I have Rhea left something open there. 64%. For me at the slam, and Alex also for, for me at the quarterfinal, uh, which I did not use, but it was, I think, 29 or something was like yeah. something that they're getting very often. Yeah, but uh, Andrea was 64%, um, 11 out of, out of 17, 30. Yeah, that's, of course, very strong. And Alex was uh, 42%, so a little less. And yeah, yeah. Alex was a... Alex faster. Was a 40, very advantage. fast time for him. Both being at their limit. And Andrea, time not in his recent top five. Yeah, this will be, I mean, if Alex can can get this, of course, it will be huge. Yeah, and uh, we mentioned that before the match, just a reminder, there's no tie yeah. break um, here for these sets. So, uh, yeah, it can go quite a while um, because someone has to lead by two clear games. And um, yeah, we're not that far yet, but just to mention it again. Yes. And yeah, and uh, let's see how the recall goes here. So Andrea was, uh, his, is already going through all the names just in his mind here. You see the yellow button, but Alex is doing the same. So bo they're both reviewing right now without... It's typing. interesting that they are doing this. Yeah, they're both doing it. Uh, I'm... I'm not doing it, for example. Maybe I should also do it uh, to, to keep this thing a bit fresher, yeah? Oh. But don't you put the first letter? No, I just write. Okay. But maybe that's a strategy that is improvable. I mean, just going through it, you have enough time here. Absolutely, um, yeah. Okay, Alex didn't start yet. And that's the same what you said before. He doesn't... He doesn't commit to any gaps here yet, yeah. so he is really thinking about the names. Andrea, very fast recall. 64 is really a high percentage for Andrea. Yeah. 64% of 30. Wow. And it looks good again. Yeah, it looks good. Alex, maybe a gap at Raymond? No? 
No, no, no. Still, still okay. Yeah. Oh, what's set here for Andrea? The double. But this, this, this looks like a typo because I think it's an Italian first name, and I'm quite sure that uh, he's familiar with uh, the spelling of that. It's like Primo, right? Yeah. Yeah, uh, should be an Italian first name. But Alex also on a good way here. No mistakes yet. So if he no gets no mistakes that... yet, I mean it's in his own control. He only has four more gaps to fill. Ashley, Helen, Cynthia, and Julia, and it looks like he has it. Wow! Nice That's one. One for Alex. Wow! If he doesn't change anything, yeah, and but I don't see this. I don't see him changing something. Yeah, I didn't see that also for cards. Yeah, <laughs> but everything is possible. So after, yeah, wow, Andrea now approaching or coming to that name here. Let's see if he gets that. Interestingly, Andrea doing Italian names. Yeah. Ah, is he like always doing that? Yeah, as far okay. as I can recall, yes. Uh, okay, okay, okay. And yeah, and Andrea fix it, but um, Alex, with a 30 and a faster time. Yeah, two to one here. Interesting. And of course, for, for Alex, it would be ideal that the sets ends in his favor before he has to choose images. Sure, yeah. And, and Alex I mean, clicks finish. Here. Alex clicks it. And nice. just just think, I mean, if Alex had done a safe images run, we would have a 3-0 lead yeah. for Alex. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, Andrea, it's, it's not super un uncommon that Andrea is trailing in a set. It happens. Five. So it's not like this is now something that he is never facing. And I think he's getting then a bit stronger. So I expect now from him maybe if... They are choosing words now, 50 words, definitely. And not, not like definitely, but I think it's a higher chance of unusual for him. 2-1, mm -hmm. Alex. Wow, Two okay. Go. This is uh, really, really cool. And yeah, just um, to give new viewers here a bit of a context. So this is a memory leak match. So they both have to memorize cards, names, words, numbers, images against each other and this time they memorized names and both um, memorized 30 names with no mistakes and Alex was a bit faster here with four seconds faster so the, he got this point here and he is now leading 2-1 in the first set and uh, the first one with four games and a two games lead wins that set and now Andrea no Alex can choose the next discipline and uh, yeah, that's it's good for him that he can choose the next one. Let's see what he's going to choose. What do you think? Is it words next or numbers? Hmm. Let me think. I mean, Alex is aware that that Andrea is strong in words, and that Andrea will most probably do the faster memorization time in words. So Alex knows that he might need one more word and it's that might names. not be enough <laughs> international names yeah that very makes, nice that makes also sense yeah uh, that makes sense I, but, did... I mean it's cool if if alex really manages to to get this now if he has a match ball a set ball and then another one so it's um a set point sorry um so he then might be really open let's say to to go for a fast time in numbers and simply say, okay, maybe I get this time in 50% of uh, the trials. And yeah, and if I get it, it's good. And it's Let's so cool see what to, happens. to see also Alex in such a good shape. I mean, Andrea, yeah. is, Andrea is playing all year long, also competitive matches here yeah. and a lot. And Alex has, does not have the time to play so much, uh, at least in competitive. doctor is working and now he is a child. And, and yeah. uh, this is super... Uh, demanding for both parents and time-wise and sleep-wise and everything. And I don't think I've ever seen him better. Yeah. That looks really, really smooth here. And even the images are um, close. Yeah. So, okay. International names. Um, let's... Alex trailing maybe a bit. Maybe he needs to go a bit faster now, but should still be okay with this pace. 
and Alex. Yeah, but I don't think he sees all the names. Yeah, he he's looking at the the last column, maybe. Yeah, only. maybe. All right. Yeah. Mm. Um, Alex and Andrea faster slightly. Of course, that's a plus. And yeah, of course, uh, the co-commentator today is not Boris. It's Simon. Um, so uh, Simon Reinhardt, the uh, very well-known and famous Memory League champion. Um, is... Hello, I might look similar to Mr. Conrad, but I'm a different person. <laughs> yeah. right. You might have seen me in some matches. I need an info box here, uh, which appears some from time to time to see. Right, an info box. Commentator. Oh, yeah, and the other and one. And Ronald is... Johnson to the rescue. Thank you very much, Ronald, to introducing me to <laughs> Mr. Kim. Yeah, let's go back to the recall, Andrea, with some names in the places. That might simply be his grab names, which he would then um, assign later. I mean, I'm, I'm, I mean, if if you say that Alex doesn't look at all of the 30, then I would not be so, let's say, concerned. But if his goal is always to look at the 30 names, then I think his second go through was a bit slow so it felt that he needed to hurry up a bit in the end and this might have cost him slightly but i mean it's not nothing to worry about yet because usually he starts later with the recall that's not unusual right he's still going through the names here and as you said absolutely correctly there is enough time for recall at names yeah Okay, Andrea here was 14 and he has already gone through yeah. all the names here. So yeah. now Alex starting to recall. I think, and I mean, it's a bit unclear whether Andrea is already struggling to add new names to his total or whether this is, I mean, usually when people think that two or three more names are always possible, yeah. So I guess Andrea might might end up with his usual 18. But here the Alex uh, train comes. Yeah, the Alex train is rolling. 18, <laughs> yeah. 19. I mean, he did 24 in his match against me. Yeah, it's, it's really, he has re really improved here. 19, 20. And I think this is already out of Andrea's reach in his trial because you see he has filled in many names with, with red. And yeah, Um Maybe Andrea can still surprise us, but it would be, let's say it would be an unusual train of events that Andrea now suddenly gets like seven more names while he's like struggling with many. So what's, what's your take on that? Yeah, I don't see him putting in here six, six more names. Yeah, six, six. Uh, yeah, right. Don't see that coming. And but, I mean, we should never count these champions out, but... It is a tall order here. And now he's here. Yeah, he's just guessing now. Yeah, he's guessing, yeah. Putting... And you don't get six names by guessing. Yeah, so it looks like that we have a 3-1 lead for Alex yeah. and uh, a set point. First set point for him. On... First set point and choice Andrea. Interesting. Um, yeah, international names played. And Andrea can choose cards, numbers, or words. Hmm. I guess he will go by words. I would say the same, yeah. Yeah. I think or it's numbers. more important. Or, or maybe numbers. Maybe he feels good at numbers. Maybe he feels good at numbers. Yeah, sure. But he, yeah, yeah, yeah. May, I, I mean, I said Andrea. I think Andrea is slightly stronger. And he also maybe knows this from the sets that very, very slightly. I mean, nobody can be much stronger than, than Alex. But I think he's just slightly more consistent. I don't know if your stats uh, support this with, let's say, times below 16 seconds. But maybe I might be wrong. I would just say from, from my feeling that in the last three or four months, I think his consistency has really improved. Yeah. On numbers, yeah. Um, I mean, they both with this is a super nice record here on numbers. Um Next time I will send you the stats beforehand because then it's easier for both of us to talk about these things. Um, yeah. yeah, but um, so overall 72% and 75 for Andrea. Um, and in the range 
14 to 16 seconds. Alex a bit stronger here, but then somehow 12 to 14 seconds, Andrea a bit stronger. So, but yeah, that's my guess. Yeah. Yeah. Interesting. It's works. It's works. Yep. Yeah, I think um, it's more important for Andrea strategically to, to think that he gets the 3 2. And I mean, then that's only one game left from M equality again. And it's his best chance. So why not? Why not get for that? Okay. But, but here, numbers. Let's take a very short look here. Yeah. I mean, sure, for both. Yeah. Sub, sub 14 times. Yeah. Andrea. Extremely good at sub 14 times. Wow. Yeah, good. and uh, Simon, if you just reload YouTube at some point, because then you're catching up a bit. Because in if you look on uh, YouTube for a while, then you're really falling behind. I always see that for me here. So just reload the site, and then you're a bit more up to date. Reload the the the, the YouTube uh, YouTube but, yeah just re refresh. Ah okay yeah. okay okay so there's a, a certain lag or what? Yeah, yeah. So, so okay so. okay okay sure sure. So, so they have not started yet. No no still. Um, Andrea left his seat for a minute or for a second. Yeah. Or... Yeah. Definitely. And while while we are waiting here, are you following the World Chess Championship at the moment? Yeah, no, I mean, who cares? No, you aren't, really. <laughs> I'm just focusing on memory sports. Ah, it's the sure. real stuff, isn't it? I mean, memory chess. Sports. What Absolutely. is what is that chess? I have yeah, heard chess it. Chess is played by three or four people in the world, of course, <laughs> yeah. yeah. No, actually, I, uh, I, I have just somehow missed it that it started. I'm not sure. Yeah, it started like two days ago. Okay, I see, yeah. Um, and any any uh, news there? Anything? No big developments yet. Uh, but I don't know the result of today's game. But I guess it was a draw. I don't want to spoil it one, but it's just a guess, so I can't spoil you. Um, and yeah, well, it's interesting. But of course, it's quite a tall order to like watch a five-hour match. Nobody has time for that. Uh, but usually, people tune in uh, when when it's get a bit more interesting. Uh, and the good thing of memory sports is it's always interesting from the beginning. Yeah, and it can also take five hours. So uh, it's yeah, right, it's, it's five possible. hours of interesting entertainment. Okay, let's see here. Um, what's starting now? Yes, Andrea again with this one word memorization, both with a very similar pace. It's always interesting how Andrea gets a bit in front and then Alex catches up with this two word checks. Yeah, it looks like very similar times. Yeah. yeah. Now Alex slightly in front. Now looks like but it's, it's really just head to head here. It's neck -to -neck. Yeah, it's totally head to head. And oh yeah, it's, who it's, is finish finishes first? That really means something here between these. I two. mean, the point is that the person who has two birds can click faster through the the uh, oh, remaining. Nice. So that made the difference here. Yeah. Alex simply had two or three less clicks than than Andrea. <laughs> 0 0.14 uh, seconds faster for Alex. And this means that this is really something yeah, in, with, in this uh, match. 50 words, it's first set Alex. <laughs> yeah, it's it's really what that means something in these matches here between yeah. these two. Yeah, they are so close that being like faster and I mean 43. Um, I'm like just the, the slight concern that I would have now if I were someone who were firmly in the Alex camp that 43 is five seconds below the fast time he has done in uh, the last year. But for Andrea, this is not something unusual. Mm. So yeah. I yeah. think slight advantage Andrea, but Andrea, what is here? A typo? Yeah, it's a typo. Sure, sure, sure. But in typo in the last, I think Andrea here with two typos, definitely. Because, I mean, I don't think there's an Italian word Messia, and there's media, and of course, it's also Componente. And um, and the stats for both, they look so identical somehow. It's, uh, yeah, I mean, Andrea... 30% and 28%. Yeah, and then I have 22, 26, 28, 28, and this is too close to call. What's the, what's the average? Average of, uh, yeah, but do you see like, okay, yeah, okay, well, what is like, where is the... Average is 48.2 for Alex, uh, but he, 
not this time. He has not done this time. They are right. Um, Is there also any way where I can see the like total average of other words over all tries because I think there's just for the different yeah right this is I don't think it's here uh, the total I mean, you can guess it it's like yeah, both it's... are around at 48.3 yeah. or something right but yeah Alex but still with a nice recall and he already started the, the recall that's a ah, good that's, sign that's early that's a that's good early. sign for him and Andrea yeah. was a gap Andrea with a gap and I mean he will definitely correct media there Ooh, and what and Andrea with the thing that if he's making mistakes at words I noticed it's mm -hmm. very often um noun instead of adjective and vice versa and that's the same here is is Mesia a word or isn't it no 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 I'm quite sure it's no word okay because it's in the grab sometimes you just misread something but okay yeah but I mean maybe it's a very unfamiliar word but I wouldn't even know what the Latin equivalent is so I have no idea I would and, be very surprised yeah, but if that's a word. Alex is okay. Alex, now what's that? Is that Alex was a typo. Just a typo. Typo. It's, typo. Now you and here it's already corrected. And now we will see whether Alex clinches the first set for one. Yeah. And it's accessible. And, and it is 50. If he does not correct this, then it's four one. Alex first set is the clearest that Andrea has ever lost a set. I think. <laughs> yeah, right. Definitely. I'm not sure if you have ever lost a set against anyone else except you and uh, Andrea, uh, Alex, no, I guess. No, Andrea never lost a set against me, I think. Wasn't there once? I'm not sure. I know it was always very close. It was yeah. always close. Oh, I had yeah. many, many set points, yeah. but it was never the the clutch or the clinch or whatever. Um, Ooh, but he what is... definitely lost against Alex at the... Yeah, oh, sorry. Yeah, sorry. I was just... Uh, <laughs> people, if you want, just uh, sneak into the Italian commentary in the chat i would love to hear what's going on there i will not go over there right now but it would be very interesting um how people react to that because they are really used to absolutely and really and really winning everything 43 okay yeah interesting so he has and andrea has logged in no 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 but um yeah there's no way you uh, know alex what okay what's that here for alex but and yeah, he's between accessible and inaccessible, ah, but, it, but yeah. it doesn't seem like it will make a difference. I don't think so. Andrea, I think, went a bit too fast. I mean, it's not a fast time for him, but it's uh, also not a slow time for him. It's close to his personal best. So with, with these times, you uh, 44 is definitely not unusual. I mean, if I also go, I mean, I always, you know, I go for like 55 seconds or something, but if I go, I try in training to, to go for something faster then it's also not 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 unusual to get a score like um, andrea has here. everything below 50 is really slow it's uh, really fast first set alex four one first set very impressive mm -hmm. and now it's really an interesting situation for for andrea how how was um, alex win at the uh, um, arena of memory um i think they had played three was it sets? also rather clear mm. in no, no, I mean, I know it was a three set, but I think wasn't it also like uh, that you also won the first set very clear and le let like 3 0 in the second and it looked like a blowout? And then I'm not sure. Um, then not Andrea sure. fought back with his numbers and won 5 3 or something. Yeah, I really have to check that. So, but I don't think the arena of memory is listed under championships, right? Uh, right. Or is, or is it? it? I don't think so. No, I don't see it. Hmm. Yeah, but you can. Arena of I mean, I have it somewhere. It's, it's already it, it's it's also on YouTube somewhere, but I don't know the result anymore. Yeah, it would be just good to have something where the stats are really clear. It contains highlights. I don't know, chat. Can you can you help us? How were the results of the Arena of Memory between these two? We need your help, chat. Yeah. In the meantime, I'm fixing uh, the scoreboard, and here we are. Uh, first set done for one, and. Now Alex chooses the first game in set two. This is also something yeah, cool for him. Definitely. What do you think he's going to choose? I think cards. maybe even international names. I think it's cards. Are you sure after that scare in the first match? Because Alex typed in the mm. match chat after it was over that Andrea had it. So it seems Alex locked in earlier and saw Andrea having mm -hmm. 52. And 
my my guess would really be international names honestly i don't know okay uh, let's see so both look yeah, like 15. alex had a good run yeah so both with a break here um yeah. both left their seats and um yeah but that was already a very exciting uh, start here the first game images andrea uh, alex surprised us here with a 12 point something and it was not too mm -hmm. But not I too mean, it far can away. go really, really quickly now. Let's let's say just a scenario. Alex winning international names. Andrea choosing images. Going for 12 seconds. Alex going for like 60. And Andrea making a mistake. It's 2-0. Two, it's two Alex choosing cards. It's maybe 3-0. And then, well, then the chance is high that the set is over in the match. <laughs> it can go really fast now. Yeah. Not, not saying that it will or so. But it's just more comfortable for Alex to start because he can get quicker into this uh, match point stage. Right. So Italian are getting mad in other stream. Don't spam here. Okay. I mean, still everything possible. How many people are over there? 500? Something like that. It's always interesting how many people Maybe, watch, yeah. watch sure. that. This is so cool to see that so many people are watching that in Italy. I mean, 500 people um yeah, watching memory sports this is this is insane this is really yeah, cool <laughs> yeah sure. but it can of course also be a slight disadvantage for the hometown hero right right yeah maybe but yeah let's see how that goes in the next uh games here so so we haven't seen yeah. numbers yet that's also something what i really would like to see yeah, numbers yeah. absolutely and i think we will see numbers now I mean, Andrea, I mean, uh, the question is, does Andrea need to need to mix it up? Okay, someone's saying 267 viewers in the Italian stream. Okay. Maybe it was more. Maybe they already went went home. Like yeah, some people I do. don't. <laughs> but it would be, it's, it would be sad. We, we really like the um, Italian viewers and that they are very enthusiastic. And um, so stay. Uh, I'm very sure Andrea will give a, an extremely tough fight now. Never write, write off Andrea. And like all the good champions or like all the great champions, I think if he's like challenged, he's, he's getting better. Yeah, and, he, and also in the arena of memory, he did a fantastic comeback. Yeah, I think yeah. in the second set when he was 3-0 down and then won at 5-3, um, some, something like that was there and then he did this 10.8 seconds in numbers uh yeah so and i think he did like 12 or 11 in the first try and then 10.8 in the second try or something or whatever. yeah probably um i really have to look it up somewhere but it's not written anywhere isn't it and um, that's uh, it's really weird <laughs> it is arena of memory results La, 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 reigning memory, world memory champion, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, maybe it's on memory league uh, in, the, in the, not the maybe. final result, but I mean, in the stats, in the games, in the recent games. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Ah, he isn't, uh, I, I now just found my uh, YouTube stream for that and look it up here. And it should be under events, uh, under championships, uh, blah, 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 arena of memory. Yes. And then we can look it up on memory league. Whew, that's just going to be a long read here. Let me just check where it starts. Okay. We have in the first match, we have Alex, Alex, okay, we have I found it. Four zero? Yeah, four zero for Alex in the first one, then five three for Andrea. Yeah, uh, but in the second set, it was not three zero, it was two two. Was it? Okay. And it was three two Alex. Okay, and, and then, then Andrea made made the um, eleven point point five numbers, and then the ten point eight numbers, mm -hmm. and then he defeated him forty eight to forty seven in words, and then Alex was like um, five uh, four two in the last set, right? Yeah, but uh, yeah, that's that's the only arena of memory, right? So I had always in mind that they had made a rematch, but they hadn't they because had, they had then Andrea won. Yeah. A month later or so won the season final also, Yeah, he won. They played the season final and Andrea won that one. Yeah. So it's 1-1 one, one and if uh, you compare them head-to-head -head in matches. Yeah. Um, 
Eros was in the Arena of Memory match. I think the deciding factor was words. I think Alex won three out of four words matches there. But mm. also not with a single 50, interestingly. I mean, it's already one and a half years ago, so or uh, more one, one year and three months. So you should not give too much about this uh, because both have changed and improved and everything. But it's still interesting stats. Yeah, and uh, yeah, Rad, yeah, Rapid asking for the score. So the first set is just over, and Alex won the first set 4 1. And they are about to start the second set um, soon. We're just preparing here, had a short break, and now we are going to see the, the second set. Choosing, choosing the first discipline is chosen then by Alex. And yeah, we are looking for what he is going to choose. It's really interesting because Andrea, uh, this time twice, was not successful with his strategy of being faster than the opponent. It did not work. At, um, uh, he simply was not faster at words, but also it, um, he could not convert this fast time into a high score. He had uh, 45, which is low for him. And he changed this last minute of the cards. I still think he should fight, feel, feel good about the cards, but I mean... It's always hard to say if you know yourself that it's only a 50-50 time mm. and then you don't make it, then maybe you're not so motivated to go that fast again at the cards. What do you think? Uh, yeah, I think the same. Actually, I didn't listen. I'm very sorry for that, but I was... Did, did you already answer or no, also didn't I was, like, hear you answer? I was just uh, clicking around here on the other uh, laptop. Yeah, it would also have been a bit weird if you had answered me because I was just talking to myself. I see. Okay. I was asking myself what I was thinking. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, it's That's cards. What people start, start like doing in our age, right? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yes, yeah, sometimes it's hard to have you. You have so I have, I have three screens to uh, sure. manage and uh, understand and a chat and uh, to listen. I know and a co-commentator and I have to manage that all. Yeah, sorry for all the work. <laughs> it's okay. Okay, so uh, cards. It is cards. It is mm -hmm. yes. Yeah, I mean, it's an interesting thing because maybe Alex thinks that he is a favorite at cards, but maybe a bigger favorite than international names. And maybe he just wants to, I mean, it feels weird to say he wants to get the cards out of the way. But I think it is an interesting strategy to do the event where you have maybe a slightly lower chance to win, but are still favored first. Because if you have that, then getting the other is almost not like guaranteed, but feels like better. And if the first thing doesn't go right, then you can you still have a good chance to like equalize that. Um, maybe that's what what he's thinking, or he's simply thinking he's strong at cards. Yeah, I think he's he's thinking he's strong at cards, and he is. Um, yeah, he so is strong at cards. Yeah, I guess, and he's always choosing it first. So I have never seen him not choosing cards ah, yeah. at the first discipline. Yeah, because you also must like know that he still has some. Uh, oscillations in his results at uh, at uh, international names. Right. Yes, improved only recently. So I don't see the match yet running. I guess they are still at the yep. prep screen. Preparations are still running here. So, ah. Saroj, yeah. yeah Saroj, thank you very much. Thank you very much. Very nice of you. Did like someone blow their nose at the yeah. moment, Alex or what? Or... No, Andrea did that. So ah, okay, Andrea. And yeah. I was not fast enough to change the camera angle. Uh, well, I need a guy. Andrea yawning, so <laughs> yeah. it's also maybe a motivating gesture. <laughs> maybe here we go. Cards is uh, about to start, and yes, let's see what is going on right now. Is What's I... your tip? I think Alex might go for something like fourteen. Interestingly, I don't think he will go for super fast again. And Andrea, I think, will go for the same first time. I think Alex goes also, also fast. 13, low 13. Ah, maybe. I mean, it's always hard, yeah. I mean, even even if they have 13 or 14, you would, like, never know, and they could also yeah, not, right. like, tell you, yeah. And it's, again, Andrea fast. No. Oh, sorry. Andrea faster. <laughs> what? Yeah. Slightly I, faster. I Alex, Alex a bit slower, Andrea a bit slower. And this looks like a point for Andrea, because I think 15 is something that he can do. Definitely. Yeah. Wow. I mean, it would still be his second fastest time in the, the whole year. So, well. 
right he was up to 16 sometimes and then he just smashed the 14 uh, in a competitive match mm. yeah but do you like know what is like weird on my screen alex had finished first it was like uh that it, it, it flashed yellow for a, a tiny second but yeah um i think that happens sometimes on memory leak um, okay. and yeah so the time was faster by andrea so yeah, yeah. that's what i can say yeah, sure. And we, of course, trust all the technology on Memory Leak that this is all correct. And now it will be a very interesting recall. And as we're already seeing, Andrea fighting back. I mean, going from 13 to 15 is not exactly fighting back, but it is enough to fight back. Now it's shuffling his control again. Um, yeah, I have to admit, I mean, I had, of course, analyzed Andrea's um, scores in all the disciplines for all of our matches. But I was not so aware that he had, that he does not that often go below 16 because for me it was not really relevant, yeah. Because back back then, like I was not really going for 16 second card times. Um, but it's interesting. But I think he is aware that he needed to like train this, and I'm sure he had put a special emphasis in training on faster cards times. Yeah, and so far it looks very good. Yeah. Ah, so yeah, he, that these there's a certain gap here, another gap, but if that's all that is, then it can be filled. And Orkan also said on his screen it looked like Alex finished first. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This, the the yellow flash was on Alex side, but um that doesn't necessarily mean that this was something yeah. something was wrong. This is I'm pretty sure that everything is good here. Yeah, absolutely. I think that's just a graphic hiccup, to be honest. So yeah. <laughs> And now Andrea needing to fill the gaps. He also has one four, which which might be where okay, the four was a misclick. Yes, yes, yes. And it looks like Andrea's getting it. Usually, if you when you're filling this, then I mean with this three images system, it's simply easier to to assign these things, right? Right. Um, um, but of course, it's also easy to mix things up. Yeah. With the two card system, you usually. Alex Have taking it. the lead. Okay. And I mean, even if Andrea wins this, it's not the end of the world for Alex. He could not expect to win every cards game. Card is not a must win for him. And um, he simply knows that over time, and in particular, if it becomes a longer match, um, he simply has the statistical advantage at these times. And he can simply go for them again and again. And either Andrea defies stats and suddenly becomes great under 16 seconds, which can happen, but it's unusual, or stats work in favor of Alex. So even if he loses that, he should simply continue his uh, strategy. And yeah. I think Andrea will get the 52 on. I stage. think so too. And that would be a, that would be, oh, uh, would be a huge okay, point for him. Okay. okay. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's, everybody knows this at a card's recall. You have these small gaps at the mm. end. And no, yo, and he clicks start, finish already. He clicks finish. Oh. Wow. Uh, he clicked immediately. You just put it in and it clicked finish. Click immediately. Uh, yeah. yeah, yeah. I mean, sometimes people, it's a matter of taste, but sometimes people um, are not happy to like stand this feeling of being un unsure about which is uh, the right card for him a longer time. And they would simply say, no, I have decided now and now I want to know. And I get this. Personally, I always try to check it a bit longer. Um, but both, of course, have both, both approaches have their risks. If you are trying to linger a bit too long at your locations, then you might change it again. Maybe also a consequence of him yeah. thinking maybe too long at the first cards. And Alex also done here. Alex done. 1 0. Only images won for Andrea at the moment. And Alex shaking his head here. Uh, it's a bit like, okay, I was slower. <laughs> Uh, but somehow getting the point anyway. And yeah. So Very impressive more. display for Alex at the moment. Yeah, for Alex, it's a bit sad that he could not attend like, what was it, like two slams? Mm -hmm. So that, I think, makes it impossible for him to catch Andrea mm -hmm. in the world rankings, right. no, no matter what like happens. Yeah. Um, uh, be, being like 
second in the world rankings with only one slam plate is still extremely impressive. Yeah, right. I mean, if he wins, yeah, he still has to win that one. And yeah, the no, next I'm one, it's not a, like saying that the uh, yeah. match is over. I was just like quickly like calculating. Okay, is there any chance of <clears throat> catching him? Also, it doesn't make a huge difference. I mean, yeah, sure. You're like first in the world at the end of the season. It's nice, but um, I think it's cooler to be number one in the world rankings for a longer time and having it at the end of the year is not like worth more than having it during a season, I feel. Okay, and images the next then? From images, the yeah. Now I would definitely, if I were in Andreas' corner like Mickey with Rocky, I would definitely say, go for a safe time, Rocky. <laughs> go, go for a safe time. Rocky, safe, safe time. Yeah, Mickey, yeah, I will do. Yeah, I will do, safe time, yeah. <laughs> Perfect, perfect uh, voiceover here from Mr. Simon Reinhardt. It was uh, a bad impression for general standards, but a good impression for my own standards, so I'm happy. It's good, good enough to be happy. It will all boil down to stamina. I'm not so sure about that, Ronald Johnson, because I think both are used to these longer matches and the match is not yet going for so long. It, it will simply go, go down to speed and accuracy. And I mean, for Andrea, now he really needs to fight back. So it seems Ronald Johnson has a podcast. Someone's mentioned this. And Saroj says that he would love to see you and me on Ronald Johnson's podcast. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> I mean, it's not up to us, is it? It's, I... <laughs> not, it's, it's, not, it's not up to us. <laughs> People, if you want to see us on Ronald Johnson's podcast, <laughs> I don't know about this podcast, then uh, voice your opinion loud and clear into the ether and let everybody hear that and maybe it will become true <laughs> okay so see again what are they choosing okay. that looks to me like i'm sure you already have told this sorry for being it's not just, completely uh, concentrated it's okay i always just... do that not being concentrated is my thing i think definitely andrea going north for 12 seconds the craft of memory is uh, Ronald Johnson. Craft of memory, okay. Because I haven't heard it yet, so but I will take a look into it. Um, yes. Yeah. Let's go, I, images. I say 12 seconds from Andrea and Alex. Super safe. With a relaxed pace. And yeah, it looks like repeat. that. Yeah. Very yeah. nice strategy. Yeah. And there you see the 12 seconds, calling it now. 13. No, 12.6. 12 seconds, calling it, you see. Yeah, yeah, I see, I see. You called it. <laughs> 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 there was <laughs> no Alex. Listen to Mickey. When I was in elementary school, there was a kid who was always saying, "I said it. I said that." I mean, I'm not <laughs> saying this when oh. I'm like warning you, and you do something nonetheless, and then I say, "Yeah, oh, I want you to eat that back or so," because I mean, I don't want okay. to do some Schadenfreude, but just like it, just like interesting how um, sometimes people don't have that much choice, yeah. It's mm -hmm. sometimes it's not so much about strategy. It's about what the match is giving you, like on a board game, what uh, the board is giving you. And, and I think Andrea didn't have much choice, but to go for something like top 40. Mm -hmm. Exactly. And yeah, with this 12 point uh, something time, he could yeah. really get Andrea under pressure here. Andrea yeah. is still super strong on images. Yeah. Also cool. this, these times here, um, 12 points. It's probable that he will get this now, sure. 89% in yeah. this time range. I mean, 89%. Yeah, yeah but still, yeah. you have a one out of 10 shot. And yeah. if you manage to get him into that range and increasing that, then why why not? Yeah. And I mean, in my matches against Andrea, I had one match, I think, in a slam or so, where in two sets I was leading 2 0 because he lost both of his images runs. Mm. So it's it like happens and now of course it's a bit of a higher pressure than in some league game right yeah right but i felt feel that he even became more comfortable and solid in images um in yeah the last right, half right, year. right 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 absolutely and it looks like he will get this uh, smooth recall here and he will also fill that gap at the end and if you have the gap at the end then it's like just just going for it. Yeah, it looks good for Andrea now. And yeah, that 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 could give him now really a push. Yeah, yeah? that's nice. Nice one from Andrea now. 
Yeah, and he needs these success uh, uh, things here, these results. Yeah, 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 yeah. Also for his confidence. Yeah, <laughs> definitely. And that makes it interesting. I mean, sure, if he now doesn't do images, then that would have happened what I've said before, probably, other than that um, Alex was international and you have a 3-0 and then something falls, either a numbers win by Alex or a words win or whatever. But here it's still a bit trickier. And I mean, now you'll see um, it's, not improbable, it's not completely impossible that Alex loses at international names. And then we see the momentum slowly turning. But I still think most probable is Alex Trues international gets a 2-1 lead. And then Andrea needs to con consult his inner fighter whether he wants to take numbers or not. Alex takes his time, sure. Yeah, it was the perfect strategy. Absolutely. Yeah. Nicely done. I totally agree. Okay, 1-1. One, one. Second set, 1-1. One, one. Next choice by Alex. Yes. And yeah, he hello everyone in the chat. Sarosh, Orkan, DMV. Yeah, and Orkan is completely right. I mean, the good thing is if you uh, pressure someone into going for such a safe time, then you can also have the luck of a difficult set because mm -hmm. the set can be as difficult as you want. If you go for 60 seconds, you don't care. Right. Yeah, and Orkan here um, telling to Don in uh, the chat because Don was maybe um, wondering whether maybe something was, was off for Alex and he decided to go safe. But I think Orkan is absolutely right that Alex knew that Andrea will go for 11 to 12 seconds. And these are then time ranges that don't make sense for Alex anymore because Alex's safe range, in my opinion, is 20. And everything below that is simply um, risk. And I mean, if your opponent already takes a high risk, why should you also take a high risk too? Chance is very small that you can beat him there to the punch. Yeah. Okay. And yeah, international names. Yeah. Will be the next one. Yes, correctly. Guessed by Plevix. And Rafik misspelling Andrea's name on Memory League in the chat with two Z and one I. This has to be corrected. <laughs> So here we go. Let's see how difficult. Yeah. What do you feel about, and in general, let's give your opinion. Yeah. About the match or the or names, or international names now. Difficult. Yeah, it looks like they are long. Yeah. yeah. But now some shorter ones. So shorter ones, yeah, sure. It always cancels out. This can also be a bit tricky because the AS at the end instead of an US with, um, with uh, the name Augustus. I am watching a memory league, by the way. Um, also a rather difficult name here. And yeah, no, difficult set. I mean, you can always see in general, a set is more difficult if the amount of three syllable or even four syllable names is high. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I guess they will score a bit lower there. But Alex with, I think, eh, Alex. The last names are a bit uh, shorter here and easier it looks. Yeah. Like that. Alex with a bit of a better pace. And Andrea again <laughs> logging in at seven seventh of seven hundredth of a second. <laughs> for let's see how these supposedly more difficult names, which effect they have. I would not be surprised if Alex has a score below 20 now, but you never know. I mean, Alex, if he doesn't look at the last five or so, but takes a bit more time there or only looks at the last five ones, um, then maybe it's not so hard for him. I don't know. Somehow my gut feeling is that Andrea wins this. Yeah. Okay. I don't know. Let's see. 
could of course be totally wrong, but I don't know, would, would somehow also fit the momentum and the drama of the match. The question is just what's, which score will be enough to win? I think you have already good chances with an 18 here. Yeah, maybe. Um, 18 is already enough to win that here. Let's see. Alex still in the recall here and the review, not on the recall. Yeah. And I mean, 18 to 19, Alex is, yeah, is doing that for like uh, 38%. Now Andrea at 12, also a big difference compared to the last um, international names that Andrea has much fewer wrong entries into the cells. Right. I don't think that he has changed his entry strategy of leaving names out where, where he's not sure, but here around the, the same time at, at the last match, I think he already had like five to six reds. And now here is, here's better though. I think this could be a good score for Andrea. Let's see. And Alex starting his recall. Yeah, already at 10 and he's just starting the recall, so. Yeah, moment of truth. I mean, maybe simply Andrea has gaps at the world and simply doesn't know them at all. And this is why he's not even entering a guess. This, of course, <laughs> is then the problem on the, the other end of the spectrum, yeah? So, so 14. I think around that time also he stopped adding names in the last trial. So, I mean, you have diminishing returns, of course, after after a while. And let's see whether he can still add more there. Quite sure that Alex won't stay at 14. But you see, he's struggling with these longer names. Yeah, and the set started with these longer names. So, yeah. 15 now. Yeah, it looks again like a point yeah. here. But that hmm, could have been different if Andrea would have scored. Yeah, but it was a tough set, so. It was a tough set, absolutely. 18. 18, 18 with that, with uh, those difficult names. What's what's here? What's what's the name? Suya? Yeah, okay. Uh, yeah, yes. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. 21, 22. Fair, 22, wow. Better than in the first international names. So, wow, that's just super, super solid here. Yeah, and I think... When Alex lost the, uh, lost the season final, I think he lost an international name. Yeah, against Korea, I right? think so too. I think that was yeah. a big surprise. Uh, and... Yeah. and I also think he lost in two sets. Mm, or was it three sets? Not sure about that, but that should yeah, okay. be easily. Yeah, it should, that should be easy to check. Absolutely. Yeah. Uh, okay, recall ends. Andrea will not enter seven more names in 10 seconds. I think that's clear. Okay, but now we are going to uh, start here with the disciplines which both can definitely uh, win. Um, no one has a big edge here in the next disciplines except images, but that will come last from Alex. Yes. So Andrea with choice. And maybe national names. Maybe, yeah. He maybe did that. Names. He did that. He chose that in the first run and then... Uh, and Alex immediately choose international names. Hmm. I mean, Andrea lost national names in the first trial. With which score again? Ah, uh, yeah, thirty. And Alex was like faster. Yeah, yeah. four so, seconds. So incredible. I mean, this this of course can be a bit of a deterrent. That uh, what what is left? Numbers, but numbers is also not a sure thing for M. Andrea. I mean, he has everything left except images. So, a white. I think the best would be national names. It looks. It looks like it is a national names. Yeah, I mean, he must also know from the stats that he is. He has a higher percentage of uh, thirty, so it is definitely uh, the best choice. It doesn't matter what you had in your last event. It matters what the average uh, strength is, and there, Andrea definitely has a slight advantage. Mm -hmm. Let's check that again here. Yeah, close and yeah, but it's a very, 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 I mean, it's just a key point here. Um, it's not over after that game. Definitely not. But 
This is, you need, he needs this 2-2 now. Otherwise, it's not getting easier for Andrea. Um, yeah, the point is, there will be two match points then. And one of the match points, I think, I think Alex will go for numbers and simply say, I go for a fast time and see what happens. I don't think that, that Alex has a question or Alex chooses words. No, I think Alex will go for numbers and say, okay, show me. Yeah, but let's see what how the how the names uh, develop yeah. here. And yeah, it's just hypothetical. I mean, in terms of yeah, the two, sure. two yeah. things are things are completely different. But it's good to see. I mean, it's it's great to have these two here uh, at such a level, and because and it feels more and more that Andrea is dominating a lot here. Um, but yeah, this match is different and um, it's not uh, finished yet. And I think Andrea is always capable of striking back here and coming yeah. back. So let's see. Yeah, the point is, of course, just um, that striking back also requires that your opponent leaves you an opening. Yeah, and it will be somehow, but I mean, going, somehow, yeah, yeah. Going here, I for, mean, a real strike back is, of course, that you beat your opponent's fastest time, and that's what they can do here. That's yeah, uh, definitely. And it's very interesting that Alex looks at international names twice and at <laughs> national names once. Yeah. Okay, Andrea seems to finish us here faster than the last attempt. Yeah, 38. Yeah, oh, 38, okay. And I think... Alex, yeah. 44. Mm -hmm. 44, yeah. 38 is really fast. I think it's, it's, it's almost his personal best. Times, times below 40 are not something that, that you second, do every day. Would be second best time for... Second best, yeah, yeah. Andrea. It's uh, 38.58. Uh, yeah. But... Very nice. I mean, that's that's at least that's how you strike back. If you do yeah, that fast yeah, time, exactly, and then you get the thirty. Yeah. Now it's again. I mean, we had many matches here, where many um, disciplines where Andrea had the faster time, where it was under his control, and where he did not get it. So, getting it now would be a very nice uh, symbol for a uh, momentum change in the whole match. Okay, Alex just filled the last name. So he looks yeah. at the last names very um, briefly and then he just puts them in. Mm -hmm. And now he's on the review. Alex done with his review and now starting to type, I guess. Yeah. So Alex and Andreas recall is running. Looks good. The first row is complete. Yeah, uh, looks very good. I mean, it's simply, it's simply very, very nice. If you have a national set that is that has rather normal names and that you simply know, like at the back of your hand, it's simply a very neat thing to memorize. Right. Uh, it looks very good here. Yeah. Very good. Can he come back with? The 38 in names here. It looks uh, like this, yeah. It looks like that. And here we are. Nice one from Andrea Very here. Nice. Super, super strong. 38 seconds. Second best uh, top 10 score here. Yeah. And that's exactly what, what we were saying about uh, striking back. That's yeah. the perfect example of someone striking back here, being faster than the opponent before. And then also doing the 30. And I mean, don't don't make a mistake. 30 names in 38 seconds is not something that Andrea does 10 out of 10. Yeah. So he was running a risk here, but he took the risk and it paid off if he doesn't change anything. So yeah. Really nice. Also, on the other hand, not being too negative, but of course, it was also almost a must win for him. So he needed to strike back in order to have an inkling of at least evening the um, match out, but that goes for some very exciting two upcoming disciplines. 
Yeah, and Alex strugg was struggling with the first name here. So yeah. he might end up with 29, but um, yeah, for uh, all viewers who are regular viewers here, they know that, of course, Andrea wins it if both have 30 and Andrea has the faster time here. So, and it looks like we have this situation. Yeah, he also wrote Sandra, which is also under the face number five, which simply I indicates mm -hmm. he doesn't know what is like happening here. Um, yeah, honestly, I'm happy that it's a 2-2 now, most most probably, um, because if you take the course of the match, I think a clean two-set win might have been too tough and not really uh, representative of what people have done. Yeah. And I guess that was Andrea? That was Andrea, yeah. Okay, Clapping nice. his hands here. Slapping his hands, don't slap the table. That's not <laughs> very nicely welcomed here. He's not recommended. In, I mean, it's body. it's nicely welcomed. All people like that. That's what people are looking forward to when they watch a memory sports match between you and someone else. They want you to slap your table. But it's weird. <laughs> yeah, I mean. But, but I understand it's people entertaining. And they might do it again in the future. You like never know. It's entertaining. You can't just say that it's weird. You can't say yeah, that. Yeah, but you know how. I mean, I had a talk with my table and it simply <laughs> said that it's not so happy about it. So I guess I would refrain from it just to save <laughs> save the table. Okay. I mean, tables also have feelings. Yeah, they are not made of wood, you know. <laughs> or maybe they are. I don't know. Mm. Okay, enough with our very funny banter. Let's go back to the match. <laughs> The match is just on pause, so yes, two two and Alex choice will be what's the check? Uh, what's the options here? Words, numbers, images, um, numbers. yeah, let's no, or, no, no, or maybe no, no. words, wait, 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 maybe wait. words because no, first... we have two two words, but he will like choose words because he feels at the moment that he's that he has a bit of an edge because of the first game, so I guess he would choose words. And then Andrea would have left cards, numbers, and words for his choice. Yeah. I think this is possible to say uh, before the number number five is down. I think Andrea is doing sit-ups. I just can't see his hand. But where's the sound coming from? From Andrea. Okay, I mean, I was like first like thinking that that he has like some that you you had like given him a microphone or so that you heard sound better and now he's doing sports on the floor and you, know, you, you see hear the you, sound. You just see because, his. Because I mean, that's not the sound that you get when someone is like there there on the floor, yeah. <laughs> because uh, the camera wouldn't hear anything. <laughs> I don't know what he's doing there. Maybe he's also doing his dishes there. You never know. It sounds <laughs> like that. Yeah, it's season twelve. It's season twelve. It is totally my fault. It's the season to be jolly, you know. I am, but the next one will be 13, so I'm partly wrong, uh, partly right, I suppose. Mm. Okay, we need a third camera next time, uh, which covers the whole room. Because I, <laughs> I'm curious what uh, Andrea is just exercising there. Maybe it's also a sacrifice to the memory gods. You never know. <laughs> yeah. It is, yeah. Okay, now he's back. He's back. Back in the ring again. But he's, uh, but he's taking his time here. Um, yeah. But Alex very calm and collected. Concentrated. But, and here we are in this oh, situation. Alex leaving the table now. That <laughs> means everyone is chat is also allowed a toilet break. Now yeah, or never. Just a short break for everyone. But come back in time. Because we don't go back in time. What? Both also back. Chat, sorry. There was a I have to day retract the, my recommendation. You have no time. Day in the life of Andrea on YouTube. There was a, uh, um, a YouTube video 
The I date? Didn't see this. I didn't see this too, but I really have to watch it. Shaz's workout and training routine. Interesting. Mm -hmm. Was it like on his YouTube channel, Ronald? Or? And someone saw him making eggs, but didn't understand Italian. Yeah, I will need to, need to watch it. I mean, I also don't understand Italian, but I might understand a word here and there, but not enough to get it. But maybe I might learn some Italian just from watching it. You never know. Yeah, both are taking their mid-set break. Yeah. <laughs> the mid-set break. <laughs> which which is, I think, acceptable because, honestly, they didn't do a break after set one. Uh, they so did. I think we can live with that. They did? They but did a break. not such a long one. Uh, it was a minimum five to ten minutes. Okay, maybe it was so entertaining talking here that I didn't even see. <laughs> yeah, I think we, we had something interesting that we were talking about, right? I just yeah. don't know what it was. The problem with these breaks is always that someone takes a break that's okay, cool, and then the other is wait, no other one is waiting. And at some point the other one decides to also take a break while the other one comes back. And then yeah, the other right. one comes back so that no one is there, so the first one goes back again. So that's yeah. uh yeah. <laughs> okay. But here we are with Maybe words. you should give both a warning, right? Yeah. <laughs> Guys, the chat. warning. Can't be. Sorry. We have like consulted with all the supervisors, the whole supervisor committee of 20, and they said, ah, please <laughs> don't do such a long break. It's not good. No, let's, let's, get, let's get serious again. I think it's good that they are taking a break with these, uh, because these will be two very important disciplines. Yeah. And yeah, the longer I think, I think Alex will take words. Yeah, he has already chosen words. Yeah, nice. Okay, so mid time, uh, mid uh, mid set break is almost over, and let's see if we see a swap and a reswap. Do you think Andrea will try to go below forty seconds at the words, because Alex was was faster at the first mm, time? Yeah, maybe. Yeah, but uh, yeah. on the other hand, Alex uh, Andrea struggled in the first attempt, and overall he just get forty four. Yeah, um, but I think it's not. It's at least not not yet so much in Andrea's strategy toolbox to go for a slower time if you feel that the first time didn't work out. And it's also a valid strategy to go faster. Yeah, because okay, no, I want to know it. And I don't want to admit or whatever that it was not good. So I simply, I think Andrea wants control in the match. He wants to be the faster player. Yeah. And I think that's very important for him psychologically. So I think he will be not slower. And you see, I think, no, pace is still the same. Okay, interesting. And Alex going back and going. So Alex is definitely, yeah, well, but Alex is still in higher pace. Hmm. Will be again a very close finish. Yeah, yeah Andrea might be a fit fire. I don't know. Let's see. It again will be up to the fewer clicks at the end, yeah. maybe. And here we are with... And... Oh, it's, it's incredible. <laughs> Isn't it the same time difference as in the first attempt? Uh, it... <laughs> almost, yeah, yeah. Alex almost, had yeah. Point, point, uh, three, one, and Amandrea had point something, yeah. <laughs> wow. Yeah, it was again the clicks in the end. Yeah. People, looking at two words at the same time, if you put two words on a location, it's not bad. <laughs> Take this advice for free. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, sure, sure. But uh, yeah, I mean, it was like um, point, point 0.16 difference. And now they have a difference of what? Of point 0.16. Yes, perfect. Wow. You you instantly knew that it was the same difference. The, it felt like this is. Uh, it is nice. the, point, the same difference. <laughs> point 0.16. Yeah, at least something I can still do. In uh, terms of so memory, much more than you can do. <laughs> yeah, thank you. Okay, now um, Andrea is reviewing here. Alex also. Yeah. Andrea was hanging here a bit on number fourteen. Let's see if um, he has to think twice there. And Alex, yeah, still normal here for Alex. Not even one minute done. 
This would be and fast start for Alex again. Your best for Andrea. a fast start for Alex again here. Yeah, nice. After one minute, starting after oh, one minute, quickly. it's a super good sign for him. Yeah. But I think also Andrea will like have a better run here. Um, he doesn't have a gap yet. Let's check closer, inverse away. What is that? Let's and check. What, what, what does he have here? Ballerino. Now there's a typo, I think. Because I think yeah, it is. Reno is simply a ballad dancer, right? A male ballad dancer. And I think he simply mistyped A. But but he is a slightly apart on the keyboard from, from A. So maybe it's also a, simply a spelling error. Let's wait for it. But let's wait what is Alex but doing. Again, it doesn't matter if Alex does 50 here. Yeah. He was miscorrecting something in the first attempt to 49 in the end. He didn't do 50, but what? one minute recall time for wow. Alex. One minute review, one minute recall. Wow. Boom. And Andrea already with two gaps. With uh, or with does is is Andrea putting two two words on a location? I think so, yeah. Okay. Yeah, but then it's really interesting that he is only looking at one word. Yeah, but for example, in images, um, he also puts two on a location. And, and he looks at one, okay. Yeah, yeah, many people look at one in images, but put two. Okay. Yeah, and one with this one. Is, yeah, if Alex doesn't correct anything. Uh, sorry, I didn't want to interrupt you. Yeah, no, it's uh, it's such such a strong uh, result here from Alex again. Yeah, yeah. And I mean, usually, I guess that 50 words in 43 is not let's say a tuesday result for for alex yeah so okay for to me it's tuesday yeah so it's 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 a very strong result it is and it is a very strong result yeah it, it is uh, more than a very strong result this is it's a, five seconds better than <laughs> what he has done in the last year yeah this is a it's yeah, a world maybe, class maybe result the best or whatever <laughs> yeah wow okay and that is yeah, it will be a match point no matter what happens here, either for Alex or Andrea, but now it looks like it is a match point for Alex on the choice of Andrea. And I mean, this would be really, really, really tough if Andrea now gets like these two missing words and says, okay, 43.29 must be enough. <laughs> and then he's beating again by 0. 0.16. So it will be, what will Andrea be choosing? But definitely, but yeah, the question is, what is he going to choose? Cards, numbers, words. Yeah. Numbers. I think he's going to numbers now. Maybe. I would like to see. Yeah, yeah, numbers. yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, words, words would, would be would be really, really courageous and maybe I think even a questionable strategic uh, decision, honestly. Um, because Alex seems to have a strong words day, and cards. Andrea must know that he's simply slightly worse than Andrea than Alex, or that Alex is slightly better. I mean, it feels weird to say Andrea is like worse because he's also so extremely strong. So I guess numbers it is. Yeah, let's uh, see here. So match point for Alex. Match point for Alex. After 90 minutes. Uh, Andrea, you see it here. He's checking the previous results on the main page. And now he has to make the decision between cards, numbers, and words. And I mean, he was beating Alex on cards at least once today. Sure. What is that? This is the fourth discipline to the left. Is it numbers? I, really I mean, he was beating him like um, um, time-wise. Yeah, time-wise. Yeah. yeah, yeah, sure, sure. But he was, yeah, all right. Yeah, but yeah, he yeah. didn't get the time, so. Yeah, right, right, right. I'm sorry. Yeah. No, no, no. But. Um, so numbers it is. Numbers it is. Nice. I <laughs> think we got every discipline today correct, right? Uh, I, think we, almost. I think we guessed every discipline. There he is again. We the, the we we said it. We thought we we called it out, right? Right? No, you, you. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> it's it always you. Okay, okay. Numbers. It's numbers. I like just co-commentating. <laughs> yeah. Okay. What? Are, yeah. What are we going to expect from numbers? We were waiting for numbers since the beginning of the match. I expect from numbers that Alex goes for thirteen and Andrea goes for eleven. Okay. That's my expectation. I, I, 
really happy that Alex is, um, uh, since he is not so, yeah, I said that before, but sometimes you feel someone is not so available for the matches and competitions that yeah. he also maybe lost a bit of motivation or, um, yeah, is not really into it anymore. But <laughs> it's not Yeah, but I mean, you have to see Alex is like, how, how old is he, like 28 or what? 29, yeah. I mean, that's still a prime com uh, competition age. So I think sure. with, with all his like talent and with all the work that he has put in in the year before, um, you, you won't see any kind of deterioration, even if he doesn't train that much. So this is still, this is still great for him. And I mean, I think Alex simply loves to compete in these high-class matches. Yeah. And yeah, there is, uh, it's hard to find a tougher opponent than Andrea. Yeah. So what's what's your guess now? How does this numbers match end? I don't know. I and no, no. in terms of the uh, if the, if we want to have a longer match here, and I'm in favor of that, would be great to see Alex uh, Andrea winning that one here. Sure, sure, but, absolutely. Uh, and you have to see, yeah. I mean, maybe it's time now for Andrea. This is the time to shine for Andrea. Yeah, this is like the the same situation that we had in the arena of Yes, exactly. almost almost identical exactly yeah and i mean andrea would need to pull off I, i'm quite sure he goes for 11 and he would need to pull this off again and let's see maybe it works this time maybe it doesn't i'm a commentator i can say what i want <laughs> maybe yeah no yeah whatever it goes <laughs> 15 seconds here it goes guys you've heard it here first alex 13 or 14 and andrea 11 or 12 <laughs> and rather 11 ish for Andrea. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's see. We have uh, three seconds to start. And here we go. Yes. No one is doing anything. Yeah, they remember. Okay, now it's started. No, oh, Alex was much too quick, I think. Andrea. Oh, Alex Fasser. No. What? But Alex okay. was again Fasser on my screen. No, yeah, it's just, uh, it's just a technical thing. This is, the time is slower, so. Yeah, but okay. Yeah, I mean, let's not like question the whole thing. But I mean, if we this, get this, no, no, this is just. I mean, this is just the the yellow flash in the end. This is nothing. This is just a graphical thing. Um, we have times here, and they say that. Okay, perfect. I would say that. So, because yeah, yeah. this is the other thing is just graphical stuff. Okay. Yeah. Right. 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 Okay. And, Alex. Yeah. Yes. Twelve to twelve. Wow. With 12. Alex, weeks. faster than I had expected. Hmm. <laughs> faster than I had expected, honestly. I mean, he was really going, he's like going for, for an all for an all out thing here. Yeah, I think he simply, no, Alex wanted to, to be faster. I think Alex simply wanted to, to end the match now with a really fast thing. It's understandable. So, third best time for Alex and second best for Andrea. In the last really year, a very good recall. I mean, if recall starts like that, <laughs> yeah. chances high that you get it. Mm -hmm. and will this be a repeat of the arena of memory? Andrea simply getting an extremely fast time in numbers exactly when he needs it, and, and it seems to be the case. It seems to be the case. Oh, come on, not this gap there. Waiting there. He's thinking about these. He's three thinking about the gap, and Alex has eighty. Ah, guys. Please don't make it here. Let's <laughs> let's be let's be good to, to our nerves, yeah. Don't yeah, but I mean you see. It's 12 time. seconds is it's, something that Andrea doesn't get every time. It's still time. Three minutes and uh, three. I four, think five, he will he will get he this. Will get I mean this, if he yeah. starts with that and if he starts with zero zero one, zero zero two, three minutes is absolutely enough time to get yeah. there. And maybe and this only assumes that he doesn't get a sudden association and gets to the image directly. Yes. Yeah. And he will enter it now. Ooh, no. No, he, he is trying out stuff. But nine wow. minutes, seven. This will be some interesting three minutes now. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Okay, so it's it's not over yet. Alex with a super nice time here. And he clicks already finished. Alex clicks. Wow, you can just wow. wait now. Two, sorry. Wow. Wow. Such wow. a safe time for him. Will we be seeing a 4-1, 4-2, which would be... Whew, never has ever won against Andrea in two sets. But it's, I still think that Andrea can fix that. He's always fixing I also think so, yeah. But he seems to be stuck in the 900s somehow. 
Ja, und maybe he's going from 999 downwards. Ja, ja, yeah, yeah, maybe, maybe. That yeah, wouldn't yeah. be the best uh, situation for him. Yeah. You know? Somehow, I think, with the, I would almost say magic of these matches, somehow I still feel, if I had to bet or had to say no, I would say Andrea gets it. I think so too. He is always, he is very good in getting stuff and yeah, yeah. Yeah, filling yeah. gaps. Yeah. 4-1 and 3-2. That's, what the, that's so interesting. Let's let's take a look at Alex on Zoom now. Alex looking intently at the screen. I always try not to do that. Yeah, I always yeah right. Try to close you, my eyes because it's better to distance yourself there, to simply be and to I I always try to assume that my opponent gets it and always try to prepare for the next discipline. Yeah. Okay, Andrea now on the on the two the two is marked in yellow so going for the tens yes um i mean the question is what he's doing at the moment exactly is he going through the image systematically or is he trying to find it yeah, and, um, yeah someone writing three four five in chat which is uh, yeah um, don't know what that is supposed to be because everybody can see the numbers there. Um, yeah, but it's, it's just it's asking what image it is for him. So I think it's just a question. Uh, he's wondering what image is uh, 345 for Andrea. Ah, yeah, okay, 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 yeah. okay. 30 seconds. Andrea really needs to show the magic now. 20. If he's just playing with us, then I he's banned from his channel for I don't account. think so that would also be a bit too stressful for yeah, I think for, so too. for himself I don't think now you 10 have to seconds game. come on Andrea 10, 10 seconds now give us a longer match now 5 and no it's that's it that's the Alex match. Mount wins the match for 1 for 2 very impressive wow very very the impressive from victory Alex. anyone has ever gotten over Andrea and Alex was the only Super guy to beat Andrea strong. anyway Wow, extremely impressive. I wouldn't have guessed that. No, me neither. I mean, yeah. If you look forward to the next match, which will happen in three weeks, yep. that's not the worst thing would could happen to that match. Absolutely. But, uh, yeah. That's... that's basically now a redemption arc for M. Andrea here. Yeah. Like in every good anime, you get a redemption arc for the guys. And now he can redeem himself in the next match. <laughs> wow. Alex. Uh, yeah, still in the chat here. And uh, wow, I mean, yeah, this is uh, this is super impressive here. The last one was so close, and yeah, Andrea, really not not looking really happy, but that's of course understandable. <laughs> but I think he's more pensive. He's more thinking what what he can do better in the next match. And Alex, <laughs> relieved, content, happy, and he can be very I can't, impressive. I can't let you win them all from Alex here in the chat. <laughs> and, uh, okay, we are 2 1 now. Yeah. And yeah, I uh, think Alex has a 2 1 lead, right? Yeah, in matches, yeah. yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But this was a match, I think, just from, from my feel, that was the match that was on the highest level between these two yes. somehow. Uh, yeah. I mean, the arena of memory was also very high, but no, almost yeah, yeah, no but, mistakes today. That's... But there, for an example, Alex didn't get 50 in words and they didn't go for these fast times, I think, for example in words. Yeah. Yeah. And, uh, okay. and I think also they didn't push themselves that far at cards. Alex, Andrea, can you hear us? Yeah. yeah. First of all, Alex, congratulations. An amazing match from both of you. Um, yeah, <laughs> these times were so close. So from the outside, it was like another level for both of you. So congrats on winning that match here, Alex. What do you think? Did you expect, I mean, 4-1, 4-2, uh, we all not just expect that, but it was way closer than it looks like. So yeah, what's yeah. your opinion on the match? Yeah, I mean, I, I certainly had a lot of things go my way. Um, they were, you know, very close. I mean, there, there was so, I mean, I, I, this is, I think, definitely the closest match I've ever played, just in terms of the times, because it felt like just about every game, I mean, tenths of a second was, was the difference between, between the times. Um, and, uh, yeah, I mean, I, 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 I couldn't really have asked for more. Um, I think I played just about to the top of my current level. Um, and just was, you know, was able to kind of, to, to capitalize on, on, 
on just about all of the faster times that I was trying to go for because I knew I needed to I knew I needed to push myself if I was gonna you know even have a chance to be in the same you know league as Andrea so I you know I I had a lot of like I said uh, you know kind of breaks that you know I wouldn't wouldn't have gotten on any given day but luckily they 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 worked for me today um so yeah it was a it was an amazing match um and uh yeah I mean it sometimes it it, uh, it takes you know <laughs> When I when I play Andrea, you know, he definitely pushes me to kind of go faster than I than I would with other people for sure. And it's it, it's more fun that way, I think, um, when we kind of both are kind of pushing each other, hopefully. Yeah, thank you, Alex. And Andrea, um, you always uh, improve here, especially for example in cards. You it looks like that you really made a step forward and a super nice match from you also, but in the end it didn't work out today. Yeah, I mean, I, I don't feel like it was a great match from my side. I performed really bad on words and also on cards, uh, in which I felt like I was also a little bit unlucky, especially in the first one. And then also in numbers, uh, I actually get the uh, 345 on the last like five seconds. But I, I thought, okay, I, I did the same in cards in the first attempt. Uh, I said, okay, I will never switch again in the last seconds, but this time was the right one. <laughs> And so, yeah, I mean, uh, I don't feel I performed really well. Maybe, yeah, only names was the good one, the other one. I mean, in cards, the time, not, not even in the second one, the first one was really good. It would have been a personal record in memory league match, but I swapped two location. And then from there, things start to went down, so. Yeah, and uh, Alex, images, the first images, that was really a surprise uh, for for us here. Seeing you with 12 seconds isn't something what we really see very often. So you did uh, train images lately? Yeah, I think in in every event, but images especially, I've been trying to just like push the speed, um, even if I'm making mistakes. I think normally, like, you know, I, I can do you know, 11s or 12s in images, but it's just very risky, you know, like it's very, very low chance of getting it correct. Um, so, I mean, thankfully, recently it's gotten better, but I, I, I kind of wanted to go for that fast time just because I knew that Andrea, I mean, I knew that, I, you know, I have very little chance of winning images regardless, so I might as well just kind of start off the match, you know, trying to kind of just get the wheels turning, so to speak. Uh, and then maybe, you know, I'd, I'd get lucky. Um, and in this case, I didn't. But the other thing was, I, you know, I thought maybe, you know, if I kind of start off faster and then ease back on the second one, maybe that'll push him a little bit faster. And, and you know, he might make a mistake on the second round. But obviously that didn't happen. So that, did, <laughs> that didn't work. But um, but that that was kind of, yeah, that's, I mean, I, I've been able, been able to get a little bit faster in, in images recently. So I've been happy with that. Yeah, so Gongrad, season 12 winner, finally, after uh, three months of a uh, break here. And uh, yeah, we are all looking forward to the next uh, final, which will take place, I think, in three weeks. So um, not too much time for you, Andrea, to strike back. And uh, I really am looking forward to that. Um, it's a good chance to strike back, Andrea. Any yeah, plans? yeah, sure. Yes, me too. <laughs> any plans for that? Uh, any extra training or just go with that? Andrea. Uh, for me? Um, I mean, nothing special because I train, um, like the events in which Alex was stronger than me were cards and international names. I worked a lot on them in cards. I became really fast, but this time I, I didn't get them correctly. Correct. And so, I mean, I don't think nothing special, just a little bit, not even accuracy. I don't know. I mean, today was a bad day for me in terms of performance. So yeah, I, I was ready. So I guess if I maintain that level, it will be okay in the next season. I think you would have beaten anyone else in the world with this performance today. So, yeah, uh, um, but yeah, thank you anyway. Um, and uh, we let you go to your Italian fans now, okay. uh, talk with them. Thank you, Andrea, and have a okay. nice time. And Alex, thank you again for letting us be part of that. Um, it's really cool that even if you can't play that often in competitive matches here, you're still motivated and uh, keeping things running here. Thanks. Yeah, thank you guys. Very, very thank shortly you. also, congrats from my side, Alex, just to, to get that in and also to Andrea for really trying to 
control the match in many uh, disciplines with uh, the faster time and you two are so equally matched that these small oscillations like I mean level can like lead to results that appear more extreme than they were really and I can can only say it was great to see Alex impressive results in words and cards and in numbers in the end and yeah it was definitely even if it was close a well-deserved win and I'm really looking forward to your next final in a few weeks and yeah thank you apart from that Bye, congrats. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, guys. So, Simon, you're still yes. here? Yes, I'm still yeah. here. So you can put yourself on the screen if you want. Sure. For another after talk here, the old generation. Um, the yeah. very old generation. The very, did you change your shirt during the match? I changed my shirt, my haircut, and my... During the match, because... I also changed my room. Yeah, did you? Okay, I did but not change my shirt, no. You had a blue one when we started. This is, this, this is still blue. This is green. What? This, this year? No, this one, the, the, the other one. This is green. No, 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 no. This is my... This is the, the same that I also had when we were in uh, Vietnam. Ah, okay. Uh, That's but... the one that I had on stage when I was sitting there with you for the TV show. Okay, okay. And then I was totally mistaken here, as always. But um, you have a nice red one on, so it's good. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, yeah, I mean, next match, uh, I think it will be December 19th or 18th. Okay. So, um, I mean, as I mentioned it before, this is so cool that we have that kind of rematch. It's not a rematch, it's a different season, but it feels really like a rematch. And I think for Andrea, it is a rematch because uh, losing another time now, does not fit into his, yep. I would say, his own... In, no. in his own uh, narrative, right? Yeah, I think Being so. Being the number one player. I mean, so, if you have a 1-3 record against someone, it's starting to get tricky to say that you are the best. Yeah, but I... I mean, I don't want to be uh, provocative in a way or whatever, yeah. I mean, those two are still evenly matched, but if you are, if you have that again, then... Yeah, but I think that this... This is exactly like the arena of memory that pushed Andrea again. And yeah. having that, I think this loss again will push him forward. I think it's actually rather doing him a favor than being, being bad for him. So um, looking forward to the next level of Andrea. <laughs> Andrea yeah, 3.0. Yeah, I think um, the, the best things in sport always came when you had these rivalries. Yeah, Fedor and Nadal and Kasparov Karpov and so these these tight matches where they have many many um, encounters and they are basically evenly matched and I mean I think tennis is quite a nice comparison because there you also have different surfaces and people are better or worse in different surfaces I mean clay is like Andreas images or whatever for uh, Nadal and um, yeah so and people are always pushing each other yeah so why I the, think this is like really, really great to see. Why is Memory League, what we're doing here, so close to tennis? I never got that. I mean... No, I just mean because... No, no, it's 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 like okay. that. I mean, we have okay. this set system. We have... Uh, um, you choose your... Yeah, your, your service. And then you have a break. And uh, you win 4-2 or 3-5. So it's like tennis. I think the, the system also basically comes from that playing one game in tennis like um, a service game yeah it takes around as long i think as it takes to have a service game um it's, it takes to have a discipline in memory league and alex and is back there, oh alex is back no okay he's okay, gone he's kind of and i think there you have then like an internal uh structure where okay if it's if um, a discipline usually takes five to ten minutes or what then you can't have a set that goes to ten mm -hmm. right uh, yeah it just fits very good also to oh. that spot here Simon, um, I can just say thank you again for you being here, my uh, co-commentator uh, with all the all your knowledge and experience in the sport. And it's always a great pleasure to have you here. Thank you very always much. Always a great pleasure to, to be here. And if you, you so want much. to wear a blue shirt next time, it's totally fine for me. Um, all cool. Maybe I'll switch next time, really, and then you won't notice. <laughs> I think I will not notice, but uh, yeah. it will be a bit like Andrea today with other cards. Then you don't comment next time because you were wrong once. So that's right. <laughs> and but then yeah. in the end, I basically say, okay, here it, you see. It's always fun 
and uh, people really, really like our team up here and uh, i like that too thank you and uh, have a nice evening absolutely same to you bye bye thank you for having me and bye bye to chat bye yeah and so there's nothing So it looked like that I was muted. So I'll just say it again. Thank you very much for watching. Have a nice uh, uh, weekend. And um, I am, um, 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 yeah, what, what did I say? I said, have a nice Christmas time all because today is the first of Advent. And uh, the next match between our two competitors is something to really look forward to. And uh, this is uh, in three weeks on December 18th or 19th. And uh, I'm pretty sure there will be a great rematch between Andrea and Alex. And yeah, I mean, how can it's not to have it's there's not no better ending in the end of the year as seeing Alex versus Andrea in such an epic match. And I'm pretty sure we will see something very cool coming up. So I just say it again. Thank you guys for watching. Did you actually hear my talk with Andrea and Simon or was it all muted? Anyway, thanks for watching. Have a nice evening and keep on memorizing. Bye-bye.